happy hump day. So this week I'm exploring some of the analogies we use to describe resilient people because the video blogs I did last week about the rubber band and why we shouldn't use it as an analogy for resilience got some great feedback. So I thought I'd continue the, the theme. So this week so far I've talked about um, resilience being compared to uh, bamboo. Monday's a long way away. Uh, bamboo. And yesterday I talked about the diamond. And I want to talk about the blow up ball. And a lot of these analogies are out floating out there. I'm not making them up. They're on the internet. Um, and I pulled this one off. And the analogy goes like, resilience is like a blow up ball. You can put pressure on it by squeezing it. But when you let go, it quickly goes back to its original shape. It's able to bounce back. So it's a bit like the rubber band analogy, isn't it? So, you know, if you really put pressure on your employees and squeeze them, they're not going to go back to their normal shape. They're going to suffer because of that pressure and the squeezing that you've done. We need to provide the support and the resources for them to cope under that pressure. And resilience is not like the blow up ball about bouncing back. And I can guarantee you, if you don't do anything and expect your employee to just keep bouncing back, they very soon will stop bouncing at all. Resilient people bounce forward, not back. They don't go back to where they were, they go beyond it, they bounce forward. The difference between resilient people and those who are not resilient is how they respond to a setback. Resilient people respond and see it as a learning opportunity and an opportunity for growth and development, where the non-resilient people react to that setback and see it as a negative experience, where resilient people see it as a, a positive experience and a learning one, as I've said. So make sure that we are giving people the support, resources, education, that we're developing our leadership to create an environment in which we can thrive, your employees can thrive, not just survive, but thrive in the face of constant and uncertain change. A blow up ball that eventually bursts because of the pressure you put on it is no good to anyone. Neither is a broken employee. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye.